So I've recently been playing a lot of Lord of the Rings games. I've been playing uh, Lord of the Rings Return to Moria, which has been really, really fun. I've really enjoyed that. Uh, and I can't wait to kind of post up the last little bit of content for you guys for Lord of the Rings Return to Moria I've also dived back into Shadow of War. I don't know why ever since I started playing Return to Moria I've just been also re-watching all of the Lord of the Rings movies the director's cut me and my wife have been just Re-watching all of them right now. Uh, we're on the uh, the two towers right now and someone called me out on this uh, I've really been saying the twin towers a lot. I'm sorry. I don't know why <laughs> I don't know why I feel like I've been saying Twin Towers since I was a kid, since I watched it, and it just stuck with me forever, so I, I, I apologize for that. But there's a trial right now for PlayStation Plus to play Lord of the Rings Golem, and I remember that uh, this game was just reviewed horribly and said that this was like one of the worst Lord of the Rings games ever. I mean, just looking at Golem right now in this screen, I mean, he, the, it looks really bad. I'm not gonna lie. So good thing this is a trial. I didn't pay for this. We're just gonna try this out for an hour, and see if this game is really that bad. So let's just let's get it. Let's see how this is. Oddly enough, there I think they are gonna be making another Lord of the Rings movie based off of Gollum as well. So. No darkness they see. Faces look garbled. No flurry they feel. No breath, no cheer. Death not to fear. Oh yeah, the riddles that he used to say before. Time is not spent. Loses has no scent. At nothing you can marvel without me. But it wasn't roses, my precious. Not roses. Lilies. Not lilies. Not roses. Which one was it, precious? Okay. So, yep, yeah, they were true. They, this game is not good at all. The reviews are true. <laughs> I mean, look at that. Look at Spiegel. He looks horrible. I'm not, I, this is the worst. I don't know. I just did not like this Smeagol look at all. I think that Smeagol looks so much better in the uh, PlayStation 2, two, two Towers and uh, Return of the King games than what he looks here. I'm Brussels. not, I, I thought I was digging the art style. You know, I was like, oh, okay, this is, this is cool, but. I mean, it's just pointless walking for Smeagol. And I mean, don't get me wrong. Some things were cool. The Nazgul looked cool. Like, there's some stuff to it that I was like, okay. Like, you know, as a Lord of the Rings fan, I'm like, I can I can mess with this a little bit. But as we just kept going in this trial, I mean, I, I mean, we're walking around, like, having to put creatures in cages, picking up dead people's stuff. Like, I don't know. It's just, it just uh, like, Smeagol's story between, you know, where he got captured and tortured you know, in Mortar up until, you know, this point, up until, like, where he meets Frodo in the Fellowship of the Ring is, like, like, that part, I mean, what, did he really do all, like, there's that, all that stuff that he did, you know, it's just, I don't know, I don't know, I, maybe I'm just hating, or, I don't know, this, this game just really is that bad, I'm not gonna, I'm like, I'm sorry, like, I, I love the Lord of the Rings, I'll play everything, I've played almost all Lord of the Rings games, I mean, I'm a big fan, I love it, like, I said, me and my wife just got finished watching all of the director's cut of the Fellowship, the Two Towers, and the Return of the King, and uh, the Rings of Power season two comes out today. Let me know what you guys think about that as well. I know I got a little bit of hate in the first season. I didn't think the first season was too bad. I mean, I mean, uh, it was good. The first season was all right. I enjoyed. I just enjoyed watching it. You know, uh, I know there's they. I don't know if it was too true to the source material. I haven't read the early, early books of the Lord of the Rings, so I might have to start reading some of those to kind of get an idea if they really did it justice. But I know there was a lot of a lot of hate towards it. But season two is out now. Gonna check it out with my wife. Might give a little review here on the channel as well. If we got some Lord of the Rings fans out there, but uh, so far, I mean, I, I'm season two looks promising. I, I'm just happy we get to see a Balrog. I mean, I love the Balrog, uh, so I'm, I'm excited to see that at least. Uh, but I mean, oh, back to Gollum. I got straight away a little bit, but Gollum. I mean, like I said, I don't know. I just it just didn't hit. I was not vibing with it. I might do a stream where I force myself to finish Lord of the Rings Gollum. Uh, I don't think I would pay. It's on sale right now for like eleven dollars. 
don't think I'd even pay eleven dollars to play this thing. I'll probably wait till it's even more on sale or something. I good thing it was just a trial. I was gonna pay to play because I was like, oh, you know, another Lord of the Rings game. I haven't tried yet. Thank God I tried this trial, and thank God, you know, I mean, I, like as I, I like to give my own thoughts on games. You know, I heard really bad reviews on this. So I was like, hey, let me give it a try. Let me let me give it a try. Yeah, yeah, no, no, <laughs> no. Do yourself a favor. Don't play this. I mean, if you're interested, get it on sale. Don't play full price for this. It's bad. I'm sorry. I just didn't. I was just not enjoying it at all. So again, let me know what you guys think about this. Am I right? Am I tripping? Is this true? And let me know what you guys think about uh, Lord of the Rings: Ring of Power. And if you're excited for season two, guys. Again, thank you. We got some more Return to Moria coming your way, and probably some streams of uh, uh, of Shadow of War. I've been I've been vibing with Shadow of War again. So let me know your thoughts on all of that. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.